the most viewed video on my channel just hit 1 million views today. That is hard to believe. Just like a thousand subscribers, I never ever thought that I would have a million views on a video that I made. I just am lost for words, honestly. So I've decided to set up this wonderful 1983 American Standard Plebe. This is definitely one of my favorite toilets in my whole collection and I just decided to show it off again. So as you can see I haven't really cleaned it up very well but it does look pretty nice on the inside. I used to ask it a little while ago on the spud area and I have cleared out the room jets. So let's give this toilet a flush to celebrate a million views on my most viewed video. I appear to have forgotten the tank. So, if you will excuse me, I have an alternative option. So, let me just back up here real quick. Bear with me, guys. I will be right back. How does it look? This is my all new, self-supported, 18 gallon high tank. And I think it looks amazing. But what matters is how well it works. So I'm gonna give you a view of the progress inside the tank. And I will show you the flush on this 1983 American Standard Plebe when that is all done filling. Now how is that for a high tank? As you can see, the water line is about here. It did not use the whole 18 gallons. And that is because I have installed a water saving flapper so I can control the time it shuts. And in the case of toilets like this, which I have now just dirtied, I do not need the full 18 gallons to make it flush out. So that allows me to give them a full flush at whatever water consumption they work best at. And this, I believe, is going to replace the old five gallon bucket that I have sitting right over here that I've been using since 2019 or 2020 when I originally made the setup. So this, from now on, is going to be my high tank. And I think you guys will like it. So let's wash this off real quick and I'll give you guys one more flush. absolutely amazing so thank you guys for watching that video a million times and I'm so glad now to show off my brand new high tank setup so I will make a video on this later how much this cost and what materials were used so that if you guys want you can build this in your own yard so anyway that is about it for this video, and I will see you guys next time.